my number one priority in life is being a dad and being a father. And that's the context. Tao's role within the context of the script is being a father. He's teaching his son how to survive in the world and, and sort of passing on his knowledge and wisdom everything he can so that his son can survive so he's when he boil it down peel back the layers he's a dad that's that's what he is and that's how i look at myself so there's a common thread there that i found when you're in a studio or a back lot it's all very controlled and you get to do exactly what you want to do uh, but sometimes when you're in nature and on location, you get to also uh, face challenges. And sometimes when you don't get to do what you want to do, you get something better. Mm. And also, uh, and just the fact of seeing this place, I probably never would have would have come here in my lifetime had I not had to come here as a uh, in my uh, uh, while shooting this film. So that's all very interesting and great to get to see all these all these wonderful places. Ultimately, he sort of forms this relationship with one of the wolves, and they become friends. And it's it's a very beautiful and and a lovely story how that happens. And they really form a real bond. And in a way, the wolf helps him on his journey. It's an unusual setting. And uh, it has twists that are unexpected as you read it. And it's thrilling and, and it's exciting. And, it's, uh, and it has a lot of heart. That's what really, really stuck out to me and really grabbed me, that it has heart and it has, it has to do with relationships, not only between father and son, but also just between humans. And I think we all share that relationship with uh, each other in, in some way or another and on some level or another. Hey, Vali here. So are you a big movie fan? Well, stay with me as I have some cool random facts for you. Due to a miscommunication on set in The Hateful Eight, Kurt Russell accidentally smashed an antique guitar from 1870 instead of a prop. The dog who played Toto in The Wizard of Oz received a higher salary than most of the people who played Munchkins. And lastly, Michael Caine was so terrified of Heath Ledger's Joker in The Dark Knight that he forgot his lines in the first scene they shot together. Do you know any other cool facts? Let me know below. And remember, we publish new videos every day, so be sure to subscribe for more great content. Bye-bye.